going on everybody hope you guys are all doing well out there hope you guys are staying safe on those roads yesterday I got stuck in a seven hour long backup on 80 I uh, came upon an accident too uh, too soon for them to start closing the highway down so I got stuck between the act the accident and the previous exit so I could not just get off and go around so yeah, I was stuck there for seven hours on I-80. Today I'm going to, uh, well, I'm going to try sardines for the first time. I know a lot of people out there are like, what's the big deal? I don't know, it's just, they're sardines, man. Grow some balls, try your, try the sardines. Let's try them. We got, uh, they're in mustard sauce, so I'm hoping that will maybe, maybe negate some of the flavor. We'll just have to see. Uh, see, I'm afraid to even open these things. Because I don't want them to stink up my truck. Oh well, that's what the air fresheners are for. All right, let's see what we can do here. I don't know why I've never been nervous about trying a food, as you can tell. It was at this moment Jackson knew he fucked up. Ugh, that looks disgusting. Yeah, I don't know about this. That wasn't a very big bite, but I can already tell I'm probably not a fan. This, is a... <laughs> this looks disgusting. God, I don't know. I'm chicken shit. I'll tell you that much right now. See, I'm not a fan of fish bones. There's a fish bone right there. No, I'm not doing it. <laughs> God damn it, I don't like fish bones. I do not like them. They're just so freaking small and I don't know oh boy I mean, I'll admit the taste is not bad it's the texture and the psychological aspect of the bones being in there. That's my biggest hurdle. But people say the bones are fine to eat because they're so small in these things. Holy Lord. I mean, it really is like, it, 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 it tastes like tuna. The fish part, well, the fish part, the whole thing's a fish, dumbass. It tastes like tuna. It's just tuna's all minced up and stuffed in the can. These are small enough that they can put them in a can whole. <clears throat> I don't know. See, the, everybody keeps telling me I need to try them on crackers, but I can't eat crackers um, because of the keto thing. And my theory behind the reason they're so good on crackers and why nobody says worry about the bones is that little bit of crunch from the crackers kind of makes you ignore the bones because, you know, you've got, I mean, the bones have such a small, uh, such a small impact when you're eating them that the cracker kind of the crunch of the cracker would overpower whatever the if there is a crunch of these bones I don't know that's my theory anyway that's my theory as to why crackers are so good with them because if they because the crunch of the crackers maybe uh, cancels out or negates the crunk the crunch of the bones if the bones have or any any you know solidity of the bones you know what I'm saying like Obviously, the bones are going to have a different texture than the meat, as the cracker will. Yeah, well, at least I tried it, technically. Not my cup of tea, guys. Not, not my cup of tea. Yeah, I'm not a fan. I've had enough now. I've had 
not big bites, but I've had enough of a bite that I can I can conclude that I'm not a fan. You know, just like I don't like to eat tuna straight out of a can. I'll eat tuna, but it's got to be in stuff. Now, it's kind of got a bitter flavor to it. Maybe that's the mustard. I've got some at home that are in an oil. I was going to make those with some eggs or something like that, but... You know, maybe they taste better if I fried them in a pan and put them with the eggs. I don't know, but out of the can like this, I'm just not a fan. No, no, mm -mm. Mm -mm. no, 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 hell no, 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 I refuse, no, 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 no. That's uh that's a that's a negatory ghost rider from this guy. Anyways with that with that all being said guys, uh, I'm gonna get off here. I'm being unloaded well I'm getting unloaded here. I'm in a door in Allentown. Uh but I'm gonna go ahead and go. So uh, we'll see you guys all later. Be safe out there.